So today I'm not going to talk about how to install a BMS or how to build a battery. I'm going to talk about why and why you should specifically do this. A lot of people are intimidated by this whole process. You know, they look at it and they think, well, I'd get into it, but uh, I don't think I can do it. And batteries are too expensive to buy. You know, I can't afford a bat. I can't afford a battleborn. So, you know, I'd love to do it. I'd love to go off grid. I'd, I'd love to build a battery for my RV, but I just, you know, I don't think I can do that and I can't afford it. But I'm here to tell you that you can do it. That building a battery yourself is inexpensive and easy to do. I almost got out of it right away. I bought some stuff to make a battery and um, I chickened out. I emailed the guy back and said, look, you know, cancel my order. I, I can't do this. And the guy said, yeah, you can do it. Um, and, you know, I, I'll even help you. I got a, a I got some um, BMS instructions. And so I learned pretty quickly on that, you know, not only can I do it, but there's a pretty good support system of people out there if you have questions. But it turned out it's pretty simple to do. So don't let this intimidate you. You can do this. I, mean, I don't have an electrical engineering background. I didn't know what 4S was or series or parallel or even what a BMS was, even what a prismatic cell is. I don't know any of that stuff. So you can learn this. I mean, this is not difficult stuff to do. And it's relatively safe. You know, the lithium iron phosphate stuff um, is pretty hard to screw up. And I mean, I've, I've screwed up a couple of times. I've shorted out a battery. And you know what? My house didn't explode. You know, uh, I had safety gear on, of course, you know, eyeglasses. You got to be prudent about this. But even if you make a little mistake, um, your house is not going to just explode into a fireball. And, you know, you're not going to just turn into ash, you know. So don't be afraid of this stuff. The second thing is, is that most people buy stuff from China. They use like AliExpress or something. And you go to those sites, and same thing. It's confusing. It's intimidating. You think, my God, I can't buy from China. This is going to be a nightmare. And I'll, I'll tell you right now, it's going to take a while. It's going to take a month, maybe even two months for you to get this stuff. But it's by far the best place to get it. You know, if you buy it from Amazon um, or, one of the, or even eBay, it's going to be more expensive. If you buy it directly from China, um, it's going to be safe. Uh, if there's a problem, they're going to refund your money. Um, it's You've got to do it. Don't be afraid of doing it. And I was really afraid of doing it. I thought, uh, Alibaba, what the hell? I'm not going to buy from that. That looks like a crazy-ass site. Now, you got to be careful, especially on, on AliExpress. There's people that sell what's called B-grade batteries. So buy from a reputable person. And I personally prefer Alibaba over AliExpress. They have their plus and minuses. But you can do it. You can get the materials, you know, watch, uh, you know, one of the videos, uh, you know, a Will video. Um, um, I'll link it here. Um, you've probably already seen this. There's there's tons of guys out there, you know, Off-Road Garage. I mean, there's a handful of these guys out there that uh, have great videos about how to do it. So you can learn how to do this. Just don't be intimidated by it. Don't let this hold you from back from doing it. You can do this. I mean, look, you're probably smarter than I am. I knew nothing. I was able to figure this stuff out pretty quickly. So don't be intimidated by this stuff. Jump into it. Build your own batteries. Gain in, uh, energy independence. Get off grid. Um, you know, get some batteries for your for your RV rig. Whatever you're wanting to do, there's nothing stopping you from doing it. And it's really cheap. And look, you can get like Lita Kawa cells, and I have videos about those. They're not particularly that great, but they're really cheap and they're 90, 95% as good as the more expensive, like Liston or E or cells. So, you know, you can get inexpensive cells that are pretty good and build a system for a very small amount of money. I mean, a fraction of a Battleborn or one of those guys. So you can do that. So I'm just here to tell you, you can do that. So hopefully you watch this video first and you go, you know what? If this dumb shit can do it, I can do it. So go watch a couple of videos on how to do it. Go buy your equipment, go buy your parts, and go do it. You will really be happy about this. You're not going to regret doing it. You are going to enjoy this. It's addictive. Once you start, it'll just consume you as a fun hobby. You're going to really, really enjoy doing this. So don't let it, anything stop you from doing this. You can do this.